Hi, I'm Dr. Ramp, and this video is going through phase three of the lumbar stabilization protocol that we use here at Revive. So we're going to start in this uh, position on all fours. We're going to start with a warm-up, so what we call cat-cow. You may have seen this before. A lot of yoga classes use this. So from this position, you're going to arch your back up towards the ceiling. Good, as high as you can go, perfect. And then you're going to drop your spine and your belly towards the floor. Good, as far as you can go here too. You're going to do a couple of these, warming up the spine and searching for what we call a neutral pelvis. So once you've done a couple of these, you're going to find a spot right in the middle that feels comfortable. Good, looking for the neutral pelvis here. Beautiful. And then we're going to move into the next exercises. This next one is called a bird dog. So from this position, keeping neutral pelvis, you're going to stretch out one arm and the opposite leg. Perfect. Hold for a second and come back down. With this one, you're going to look to keep your back flat. A lot of people have a tendency to rotate through this, and that's what we're trying to avoid. Good. And then we're going to move into glute bridges is our next exercise. So I'm going to have you roll over onto your back. Perfect. And in this one, keep your feet on the floor just like this. Good. You can scoot your feet out just a little bit. That's good right there. And then you're going to find a neutral pelvis first. So press the small of your back into the floor. Good. Next, you're gonna squeeze your butt cheeks and then lift yourself up towards the ceiling. Good. Hold for a second and release, come back down. Good. And do the whole process again. So press it down, good, squeeze and lift. A lot of people forget to squeeze their butt first, in which case you're not gonna be activating your glute muscles and using more of your quads, which is not what we want here. So you should feel a little bit of a contraction in your abs and in your butt throughout this whole exercise. And then the last one we're gonna move into is called a dead bug. So again, here on your back, you're going to bring your, yep, press your small of your back into the mat, bring your arms and legs up to 90 degrees. Perfect. And then you're going to drop an opposite arm and leg out and bring them back together. This is essentially a more advanced version of the bird dog. Um, you can see you may have to work your way up to this. This uses a lot more ab contraction. Dr. Bloom's doing a great job here. Again, making sure the small of your back is pressed into the floor. Abs are contracting. Beautiful. So you're going to start with three sets of 10 reps of each of these exercises. If you have any questions on any of them, please let us know next time you're here.